So hey guys, in today's video, I'll be reviewing this Alpha 3 ROM for our Galaxy J7 2016, which has this always on display. And this is a mod, not a original always on display. This is a AOD clone made by a developer. So don't be wrong, like this is the clone app. And I will talk about it later in this video. So let's start without wasting more time. So guys, the Alpha 3 ROM is like any other uh, TouchWiz custom ROM. But it's normally based on the J7 2016 as you can see the model number is J710MN Software Info 7.0 Nougat Soft uh, Samsung Experience 8.1 Alpha 3 DC Music C3 The same developer of the Supernova series And we can see some of the mods are added here As you can go to the advanced features We get app lock Also the game launcher tools were already uh, there multi wind is there so it's not removed let's go black going to display we also get the edge screen as you can see you get the edge screen edge lighting is also there but it doesn't work so you can just control the edge screen here we get all easy stuff normal stuff we normally get also we get the capture screen and you can record screen too so that's really awesome plus we also have the performance mode so you can enter the performance mode and set it according to you. if you're playing a game get into game and you can just increase brightness the game launcher and game tools on then you get the entertainment mode you get the UHK upscaler to get some good sound for the music and videos and the high performance mode to increase the brightness uh, it's just a normal performance mode like your phone will like just tweak it something that's Samsung tools only so I don't think so much difference we can get but this ROM is fully stock based also fully debloated so all of these apps are my installed one and normal apps were just there no email app was also there so that's a really great thing fully debloated and that's it guys for this review so the installation is really simple but still I will show you because there is a AOD mod too so let's move the installation now so guys to install this just power off your device now boot your device into the TWRP recovery by pressing the volume up the home and the power key now just go to backup if you want to uh, recover your older ROM after flashing this and swipe to backup you can restore it from here then go to wipe advanced swipe the dynamic system cache data okay. and swipe it to wipe then go to install and uh, use this alpha 3 and then uh, let's swipe to wipe here then go back and go to the AOD mod and just swipe to wipe and you will just boot and you will get the AOD mod and also talking about the AOD mod let's just talk about it now now let's move to the AOD and it's just a AOD clone it's not the original always on display so you need to go to lock screen and security and you can see always on display just enable this and you will get so first time let me show you the layout so these are the layouts not properly like adjusted you can see it's not properly adjusted also this is a clone so it may cause burning so let me show you that this is not the original one let's go back about always on display you can see the app is a mimic of always on display feature found on s7 s7 edge so guys this is not the original always on display i will suggest you not to use this for a longer period of time or your phone will cause a display burning so guys that's it for the video if you guys like this video press the like button also if you guys didn't like it press the dislike button also subscribe down for more videos and goodbye guys we'll see you in the next video bye bye